Excellent. So could we turn to um, perhaps what you do in your personal life to maintain your health? So what, what, what's your kind of exercise and, and diet protocol? Yeah, I think our main, my main challenge is really managing stress. <laughs> right. So there is so much, you know, going on and um, so kind of being able to disconnect and uh, kind of reset our minds. Uh, it's where I struggle because I think I could, I could do better. <laughs> But uh, in terms, uh, so what I do for that is me it's meditation. I, mm. I try to meditate at least 10 to 20 minutes every day, every morning mm. uh, after I wake up. Then I, I usually also like to exercise in the morning. So I'm mixing um, strengthening exercises with uh, high intensi intensity intervals. Uh, training because I want also to improve my uh, cardio conditioning. Uh, I have, you know, a history of cardiovascular disease in my family. So I'm making sure that, you know, I'm keeping my heart, you know, working. And, <laughs> <laughs> yep. uh, so for sure, all of those um, high intensive types of training really help. And then my diet, it's basically a whole food, more plant-based diet. Mm. Uh, I also decreased a lot uh, the amount of red meat that I eat. So I still eat fish uh, from time to time, but it's basically uh, more on the uh, plant-based diet. Mm. And then I take a few supplements. Um, I, I take... I, I was taking uh, fisetin or fisetin, uh, that's the flavonoid that, that also, uh, we test in, in the lab. So it's good that, that we have the ability of testing different compounds in our lab because we can see what really works. And, and uh, fisetin, we saw, uh, we saw good effect. It needs to be to a certain concentration though. So if you don't reach 20, in our case, if I'm not wrong, was 20 micromolar, uh, you don't see the senolytic effect. So I think the challenge is for us taking as a supplement is that we never know how much is really being absorbed. And if we are reaching that concentration that <laughs> the, the supplement is really, you know, being effective. But again, if, uh, if it's safe, at least uh, there is not much like to, to load so uh i mean it's interesting that you actually tested that that that's that that is really interesting and so how how often how much fecitin do you take and and how often although i i agree with you it with all these supplements it's so difficult to actually know how much yeah. is being used or is getting into your body yeah so i take 20 milligrams per kilo uh and then I, I divide the dose in two days. Uh, so for example, if I need to take 1800 milligrams, I will have 900 milligrams one day and 900 milligrams the next day. And I do this once a month. Um, Interesting. Okay, excellent. Yeah. Thank you for sharing that. <laughs> um, so I, I, we, also, we also tested NMN and we also in, in the lab. So NMN was also like, a, you know, a supplement that we saw yeah. um, an effect on senescent cells. So that's another one that I'm, I just starting. Uh, yeah, I just started to take recently. So uh, in, interesting. How much, yeah. how much NMN do you take an, a day? So, yeah, so I started uh, with five, uh, 500 milligrams, but then um, um, I think I can go up to 1,000 milligrams. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. It, right. It, it seems to be, yeah, I mean, that seems like a reasonable dose. Um, that, that's what yeah. I'm on, one, one gram, pretty much. And you, and you have seen very interesting uh, results, right? I, yes, yes, we have. Um, I mean, certainly my age has gone down. I mean, whether it's the NMN, we're not sure, but um, mm -hmm. yes, it 
I, it certainly makes me feel more energetic. So, mm -hmm. you know, um, I, I think, I think NMN is, is definitely worth, worth the effort. Yeah. It's definitely worth it. Yeah. And, and again, based on the fact, and of course, uh, there is always the, the doubts of how much we're absorbing and really have in our body. But it, this is another one that we tested and we saw a result. And it's very rare where, of course, we tested like to see an effect on senescent cells. And it was interesting to see an effect of NMA on senescent cells, but we did see. But it's rare to see effect from a lot of those supplements. So for example, we also tested um, metformin and all of them they have like smaller effects so it's almost like on that uh, limit that's significant not significant and at least with uh, fisetin and nmn um, was more clear the effect that they were doing something you know so that that encourages <laughs> um, <laughs> to try <laughs> that is yes that's that's really interesting yes that's great so yeah thank you for sharing that um okay so is there yeah where, where can people find out more about you and and one skin and uh kind of follow any of you follow your work yeah uh, <clears throat> uh on our website we have uh, um Usually, we, I, I really encourage people to subscribe to our newsletter because we are always sharing updates. Uh, if we have, you know, a beta test or a beta study coming up, we will offer to our mailing list first. Mm. So I encourage everyone to subscribe to our newsletter on our site to, you know, get the latest updates. Uh, we also, yeah, I'm also on LinkedIn, so people can um, search for my name, Carolina Reyes Oliveira. Uh, there is also the link to LinkedIn on, on our website. And um, yeah, but uh, on so social media, uh, we are all on social media, Instagram as well. So, Okay, excellent. We will uh, put those links into the description for, for everyone. Yes. Um, and yeah, I'm I'm signed up to your website, to your um, your newsletter. Thank you. Ah, oh, very yeah. great. Yeah. yeah, awesome. Okay, so um, Dr. Hayes, thank you so much for joining us today. And um, yeah, I look forward to watching One Skin moving forward. Thank you so much, Richard. Uh, okay. Have a great talk. Okay. Bye. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. I hope that you found the video informative please do hit the thumbs up button, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button and choose all for any new video release notifications. It encourages us to continue to create more videos about anti-aging and extending healthy lifespan. Thank you so much for your kind support. I wish you all well and we'll speak to you again soon.